apartmentguide.com just ranked Charleston as the number one best city for vegetarians. So I'm here to break down my top five vegetarian friendly restaurants starting right now. Hey, I'm Bill Olson, a realtor with ERA Wilder Realty here in Charleston. And being married to a vegetarian has really expanded my horizons. We are always looking for new places where she has more options than just one. So we're here to break down our top five vegetarian friendly restaurants in Charleston. Number five, The Butcher and the Bee. Don't let the name butcher fool you because while they do have meat options, they do have an extensive vegetarian menu as well. Um, located on the Upper Peninsula on Morrison Drive, um, you're gonna find an eclectic menu that's constantly changing and evolving based on what is fresh and in season. Um, some of the staples you're gonna find there on the small plates, um, you can't miss their fresh house pickled vegetables as well as the whipped hummus. Um, so definitely check those out. And they also have an extremely talented bakery staff as well, making breads and pastries daily. Number four, Dell's Uptown. Located at 511 Rutledge Avenue, Dell's Uptown is a small yet lively little restaurant where most of the menu is vegetarian or vegan friendly. Both the food and the decor at Dell's is very vibrant and fun, and you can almost always hear reggae music playing from the speakers to transport you down to the Caribbean. With unique vegetarian takes on old favorites, one of the more popular dishes is the jazzy pizza. Topped with cheese, peppers, mango salsa, avocados, rice, black beans, just this wonderful melt in your mouth flavors. Uh, it's one thing that can't be missed if you're a vegetarian either living in or visiting Charleston. Number three, Verde. I know you're probably thinking, ugh, another salad. I've had enough salads. Well, Verde is more than just salads. Um, with a seemingly endless amount of toppings, um, you can build your own salad or choose one of their staples or monthly specials, and you can also do them in a wrap. If you do get it as a salad, you do have the option to have them chop it up for you, and they've got four locations around the low country. Number two, Gnome Cafe. This fully vegetarian and vegan restaurant is located on the corner of President and Cannon Streets just across the street from MUSC. Open for only breakfast and lunch. On the menu, you're gonna find a great mix of sandwiches, salads, and desserts with quality ingredients and bold flavors. And our number one vegetarian friendly restaurant in Charleston might come as a little surprise to you, but it is Taco Boy with two locations, one downtown on Hugie Street and our favorite down on Folly Beach with one soon to open in Nexton in Somerville. If you asked my wife what her favorite meal was in Charleston, she would tell you Taco Boy's nachos. Served in a deep dish pan piled high with chips, cheeses, guacamole, sour cream, pico de gallo. It is a meal in itself, even though it's on the appetizer menu. For the fully vegetarian option, make sure you get it with the black beans and not the cowboy beans. And to wash it down, get one of their signature frozen screwdrivers with a floater of Grand Marnier. Well, there you have it. My wife and I's top five favorite vegetarian friendly restaurants here in Charleston. What's your favorite? Drop it in the comments below and let us know what we need to try next time we go out for lunch or dinner. Thanks again for watching. My name is Bill Olson with ERA Wilder Realty. And if you liked this video, please like and share with your friends. And if you really liked it, please subscribe to my channel as I put out new videos every Monday about the Charleston area, things to do, and the real estate market in general. And don't forget what your parents said growing up. Eat your veggies. Bye. See you next week.